Well, I suppose this is going to be my reboot. Uh, I have a whole list of stuff here to talk about, but I don't know if I'm going to make it. I'm not going to edit any of this, and I'm shooting it on my phone. It's just getting me back in here. I suppose it's 2021, and this is episode one. Let's see, December 18th, 2018, no, December 20th, 2018. I was diagnosed with benign proximal positional vertigo, otherwise known as BPPV. And that took me down when you can put it with AMS for a while. And then, of course, COVID and then cancer and surgery and treatment and such as that. Fortunately, I didn't need chemo, so I kept my hair. Um, David got the virus. I didn't. So he has antibodies, and I need to get on the list for the vaccinations. But we got past it. Um, cancer treatments and follow-up stages now. Just checked and rechecked and rechecked and rechecked for a couple of years. Uh, Friday was my last radiology appointment until October. So I'm pretty happy about that. And as far as I'm concerned, that's great news. So now I'm trying to drag myself kicking and screaming back into the real world. Or maybe the cyber world. I don't know where I am anymore. I don't think anybody else does either. Uh, as a maker, I have so many things going on. <laughs> I'm only now beginning to feel well enough to see the dirt that's accumulated over the last two years. But I'm on it, and I'm starting to get some headway on that. I had a storage unit. We decided to move everything into the house so I could go through the storage unit and then I got the vertigo. And everything came to a screeching halt for quite a period of time because the vertigo upset the MS which upset everything. My apple cart was tipped over. Um, like I said, I have so many things going on. I don't even know how this is going to happen. It may just be random projects and growing things and cleaning things and throwing things out and making stuff and just basically everything and anything. I have enough craft supplies from shutting the studio down to, oh, I don't know run a small business for a period of time, I believe. And it's everything from fiber and what to do with fiber to aquaponics and fish. Uh, of course, decluttering in the house is a mess. I've got to get that cleaned up so I can do anything else without making it worse. Um, Thanksgiving of 2020... The Tuesday before Thanksgiving is when I finally started coming around and cleaning stuff. And um, I can see floor in places. <laughs> I don't even pretend it's clean. I'm embarrassed to have anybody see it, but it'll get there. Like I said, I'm coming back to life, so I will get it. I'm just trying to be honest in my recovery. Um, this is just a really quick vlog, mostly to get myself out here and put myself back up on there and not put it off until tomorrow because, well, it's scary. Uh, it'll all be okay. I got the garden fence up and I plan to figure out how to make a gate for it so that the neighbor's goats and the coyotes and the rabbits and such don't get back in there this year. Last year I started the garden and then cancer and surgery and treatment and I just lost all urge and most of that was pain meds. Um, and as I settle more into a routine, I'll probably come down 
whatever it is that I'm trying to do here. Excuse me. Did I say that I wasn't going to do any editing for a while? I have to get a new computer. So right now it's all on my phone. Uh, works in progress that I'm going to show right now because I'm not pulling anything else out. Because mess. Is I'm making foot sweaters. Most of these will be donated to... Here's the one in progress. Most of these are made from scrap yarn, and they're going to be donated to the cancer center to keep everybody's feet warm during treatment. That was the worst part of anything, was my feet were always cold. Uh, like I said, it's a little more random, because I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just doing this to make myself do it. I'll get there. It's just not going to look like a podcast for a while, because, well... I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I didn't much know what I was doing before. Um, I started my first set of blo uh, vlogging, I guess. It, vlogging and podcasting, maybe. Uh, 15 years ago. And did pretty good with that for a while. And then, you know, life explosions. My son got sick, had to have part of his lungs removed on both sides, and he's doing okay now. He's outlived his projected lifespan by four years at this point. <sighs> Enough whining. Thank you for being here, and even if you're not here, I feel like someone's visiting and encouraging me. Uh, I hope everybody is surviving the great isolation just fine. Be safe, be well, be happy.